Alright YouTube users, I said I was going to upload a new setup video soon. Um, first off, uh, I have an iPhone now because it was cheaper to get an iPhone from my carrier than it was to get a flip another flip phone. And although the video looks pretty good, it is rather jittery and shaky. So if you get motion sickness like I did watching the first attempt to film this, it might be helpful to pause the video for a bit or look away after each light finishes starting and then look back if it'll help because I even got motion sickness watching the initial attempt at filming this but uh, no matter how steady I try to hold the iPhone some jitter seems to be inevitable so okay without further ado here we go that fixture is a uh, homebrew lead lag setup there's a capacitor in series with one of those chokes to make it high power factor as well as a uh, a third choke to act as a starting comp that switch controls more by the way F8 T5 mini shop light homemade I also added a capacitor in series with one of these chokes but found that uh, you know it, I didn't need the starting comp on this one desk strip once again, I know the desk is messy. Sorry for the eyesore. Ooh, we're getting some mad swirling action here. There's Penny. Pennington forceps. Anyways, continuing on. Yes, that wrap has moved out of the closet, and it's now also a lead lag preheat setup. See if I can flip the switch and move back far enough to see both of these start up. I got this a uh, power twist lamp in 2008 and it, it already came with this end blackening it was well used yet it's now 2012 this thing is still running and I've had it in use almost every day for se at least several hours most of the time so these things can really hold up of course we couldn't forget this beast that I got from my high school It's all rapid start again, except for this side right here has four lamps instead of two. The preheat ballast that I stuck in there got overheated and cooked itself, long story short. You can kind of see that the inner and outer tubes start up at different times. An interesting little thing about it being four lamps. Let's. It was harder to see with the diffuser on, let's see if it'll do it. Again, no, they all started at the same time this time. Sometimes they all start at the same time, sometimes the inner and outer tubes start at different times. Let's try this a few more times. Well, they flickered at different times, although they finished starting at the same time that time. Try another one. And one more. Uh, that'll work for now. That's a different troffer than before, although it still has a magnetic F32 T8 ballast. 2x4, 2 amp. It's got these little reinforcement bars inside of the diffuser. And these are key rings I added myself. They didn't come. The original latches are short and stubby, but they had holes where you could add these. Yeah. 
and that is uh, my current setup as it is. Once again, sorry about the jittery handheld camera. Like I said, hopefully, uh, hopefully you didn't get motion sickness while watching this. Hopefully, and if you're susceptible to that, hopefully my suggestions earlier helped. Anyways, uh, that'll be it for now, so thanks for watching.